Do you want to know what to do when Bitcoin trades sideways? Well, over the past two weeks, Bitcoin has ranged between $28,000 and $31,000. And yes, we're all glad to have a breather after the Luna crash, but two weeks in, and this thin range we found ourselves in is getting boring. And the narrative is conflicting. Macro correlations are bearish, but institutional adoption is bullish. It's hard to know what to do. And absent a big market moving catalyst, price is chopping between levels with no real conviction either way. So how do we make some money in this situation? Well, first things first, this is a sensitive market that's treading on eggshells. That's not really any good news in the world right now. And odds are things will get worse. So reduce your size, manage your risk and trade the range. Forget a Hollywood trade. If you get greedy and caught offside, the Marines aren't coming to save you. You'll need no or low leverage, tight stops, and take profits while they're on the table. If you've been following our recent videos, you'll know that we think that the risks remain to the downside. That's just our take on a cloudy market and won't change until the facts do. The VIX has dipped gently, but a golden cross remains on the cards, suggesting a sharp pickup in volatility may soon follow. And the Fed is set to start quantitative tightening next month, starting with $47.5 billion in balance sheet reductions a month from June to August, jumping to $95 billion by September. Combined with rising rates, this isn't bullish for any asset class, let alone crypto. To the downside, keep an eye on these levels. Looking at the CME futures data, we can see unfilled gaps that have not yet been filled, which price could gravitate towards once momentum starts. Stay safe.